turning a yard full of gravel into a garden full of green isn't easy. But with the help of designer Robin Hagelin, the Howe family has watched their yard be transformed into their own private Eden. Our new front yard, it's just amazing. I mean, we're so thrilled with it. We've turned a moonscape into an incredibly useful space for us. The kids love it, we love it. We're, in fact, our house, we're not even in half the time anymore now. With the garden starting to bloom, Robin's come by to see how things are coming along. Where better to begin than the dramatic new entryway? So how do you guys feel about the new uh, garden, the front, the new wall? And <laughs> This wall it. is amazing. Yeah. I mean, I don't even know if you can call what was there before a wall. It was just a bunch of crumbling stones, but it gives a lot of definition to the entryway, and it makes a statement um, for people coming off the street. And how Absolutely. do you feel about the big column? I know that was when we went back and forth on it. Yeah, yeah, it was a change order out, change order in. I'm glad that uh, I'm glad that you got us to include it um, yeah. because we think it looks great and it really ties off the end of the wall really well. Terrific. Just inside the front gate, Robin has created a special space for the kids to call their own, and the stepping stones fit in perfectly. Robin, I love how the kids' play area turned out here. The kids climb on these rocks all the time. Here's the pea gravel here that you can see, which uh, looks like they're loves. There's it. been a bit of a paint fight going on here. And you know what? I don't care. It's not in the house. It's, That's the it's, purpose. This is their play area. It's wonderful. Great. Well, that was the purpose of this area, was mm -hmm. to create something for the kids. And speaking of the kids, you wanted to hide all of their yes, uh, all yeah, toys. Yeah, they filled it up already. Totally um, full of stuff, but that's great. It's it's out of the yard at the end of the day, the and uh, the cushion here. It's great for me just to sit back and and be the family umpire, <laughs> right? <laughs> when when needed, but it's it's actually very relaxing. On the other side of the yard, new plantings will provide some cover for the fence and a bit of color for the garden. And then we have in the background are the oak leaf hydrangeas that we picked out. You can see a little bit of the bloom going on. And then you wanted to cover this fence. Yes. And we do have the climbing hydrangea planted against the back. Lovely. Train Great. it up and it'll attach itself and start covering up the back there. The hydrangeas will be beautiful, but the stunning basalt column water feature is what really catches the eye. All 3,000 pounds of it. Yeah, so one of the highlights of the entire construction process was watching them struggle to put those stones in. They had a big crane and, and, and you know, it took quite a long time, but the end result is well worth it. So when people come in, it's the first thing that uh, they see in the garden. Yeah, it and really draws wonderful. the eyes. The old tree used to be hidden from view. Now it stands out as a lush backdrop to the water feature and patio area. Robin, this used to be such a mess, such a jungle, and now it's all cleaned up. I mean, it really is, has enlarged the size of our yard. That was the hope, was to really reclaim some space and really be able to feature this beautiful tree that's in your garden yeah. and that's highlight it. The new patio and dining area also draw the family outside. We sit out here and eat all the time. We love in the it. Evenings. And it just means that Scott and I can now have a, finally have a place that we sit and have our dinner. The children run around, they then come back and join us, and that's what we've been wanting for so long. It's a yep. great outdoor patio, and you've delivered it to us. So, what do you think of the containers in the rain chain here? We love them. It's such a great focal point when you walk up to the door. We hear it trickling down, waters the plants, dual purpose. That's and then fabulous. mirror the lights throughout the garden, and that, that repeated use of copper looks mm. fabulous. That's great. It's so much more beautiful than just having a gutter run down mm -hmm. next to the front door. Absolutely. Yeah. Large stepping stones across a carpet of green grass and colorful beds of pink and white flowers complete the picture. Done such a great job that you're about to start on the back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't right. wait! It's going to be fun. Yeah. It's going to be great just to tie it all together and really help finish the uh, exterior of your beautiful new home. Thank you so much. Thanks Thank you. A lot. Awesome uh, job. In your run, you want to go straight over and play with your trains? Thanks to Robin Hagland, this garden's become a perfect haven for the whole family. Thanks for joining us on Landscapers Challenge. We'll see you next time when we put three more landscape designers to the test.